Hello guys, in this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to create an interactive radio button using components. First I'm gonna create a circle using the ellipse tool, then I'm gonna fill it with white color. Next I'm gonna make a copy of the circle. Use Ctrl plus C and Ctrl plus V for copying. Then I will reduce the size of the new circle and I'm gonna fill it with a blue color. Now I'm gonna make a copy of the circles then I'm gonna change the blue colored circle to white from the first two circles. Then I'm gonna select the first two circles and right click then select create component option. Now I'm gonna do the same with the second set of circles. You can also use the dedicated button for creating component. Next I'm gonna select the two components and click the button combine as variants. Now let's go to the prototype mode. Click on the first component and drag it to the second component to create an interaction. Choose Trigger Tap and Animation Smart Animate. Now click on the second component and drag it to the first component to create an interaction. Choose Trigger Tap and Animation Smart Animate. You can see the newly created component under Assets then Local Component. To use this component we have to create a frame and then we have to place the component in it. I'm gonna use the iPhone 13 Pro Max frame for this tutorial. Then I will drag the component to the frame and add some text next to it. You can always change the size of the component after placing it to a frame. Now click on the play button to view the component interaction. If you find this video helpful, please don't forget to like comment and subscribe. See you in the next video.